What's up everybody? Welcome to the channel and today we have a review for DeWalt's earless wire buds. Let's get into it. All right, so let's dig into DeWalt's offering of the wireless earbuds. All right, so first thing you're going to notice when you rip this out of the package from Excitement, it's huge. It's really, really big. Let me show you how big this thing is. So this is the Pro Case. You can see the size difference on that, the thickness different on there. Um, if you're like me, these right here always ended up in my pocket. Uh, I can put these in my pocket, but it's, you notice it. You definitely feel like these are in my pocket. These, sometimes I would forget them. Uh, so maybe that's a good thing. Maybe that'll keep this from getting uh, washed in the washing machine. Not that this has ever happened with this but once. So, uh, first things first, let's talk about the connectivity. That's the first thing you're going to do. Uh, they connected really easy. I got an iPhone 12, went to settings, Bluetooth. It paired immediately. No problems with that. When you do that, um, it will immediately tell you whether your battery is high, low, or medium, whatever, you know, whatever it's going to be. You can also see that by opening the lid and you see you got four LED lights right there. Uh, think of those as percents of 25, 75, 100 uh, percent. Pretty obvious what that means. Uh, when you got these things open, that's one that I, I wish the lid would stay open. The lid doesn't stay open, but it is magnetized, so you don't have to worry about that. Uh, as far as taking these things out, you can kind of see where that it looks like there is meant for like where you pull this. I felt the easiest way is to come right up underneath it, and it just pulls right out. It almost like it wants to come out when you do that. Uh, these have a magnet in that as well, so they go right in where they're supposed to be. Um, very comfortable. I would compare these to the Pros. I feel like the Pros are pretty comfortable. And as far as these being in your ear, no problems with uh, them wanting to come out. Like the original uh, AirPods, I feel like they were, they really didn't fit my ear all that well. Uh, but these fit snug. You have options that come with it to change that out to bigger or smaller. Uh, and then options, if you were to lose this, you can replace them. Uh, but these seem to stay on pretty good. Uh, let's see what else. Okay, these operate typically like you would assume. That little button right there is to pause or play. You got your uh, volume up or down, which also will be able to select a track forward or backwards. So all that stuff's pretty obvious. I think most everybody is basically the same thing. Uh, playtime. All right, so the pros give you four and a half, five hours. I feel like I personally seem to get more through the day than four or five hours, but that's what the that's what the box said on these. These are seven and a half hours, but with the case and you charging it over and over, you will get thirty hours. It claims these were like twenty four hours, so you should be able to listen to more music with the Dewalt ones than you can the pros. All right, so let's go to the, I guess we'll go to the, the cons, I guess, of this. If you, if you have these and you, and you like them, you like the sound of it, all that, um, these will probably be a bit of a disappointment for you because uh, this has better bass. It, it just does have better sound quality than DeWalt. And I kind of expected that because they're not necessarily known for you know, producing um, really nice stereo sound right um but they're they're good for what they are so as far as being in a construction environment um they're 80 bucks and you know we're comparing a 80 dollar earphone to a 250 dollar uh earphone there's not really a whole lot of comparison you can do uh with that like so keep your expectations where they should be and this is not going to compare to the pros it's just not Here's one big reason why they're not is, as you know, the pros have noise cancellation and I wish that these did have that as well, but they do not have that. Um, <clears throat> but they are able to crank the volume up really loud. I put these things in, running my saw, had this thing cranked up and it was hard to hear the saw and it was really, really loud. Probably not great for your ears. Having the noise cancellation allows you to lower the volume because you don't need it because it's blocking everything out on the outside. These don't have that, wish they did. They do have the uh, IPX6, um, what do you call it, water resistant. So I don't know if that means you can wash these in the washing machine or not, probably shouldn't do that. 
but maybe if you drop it in the puddle or in the pool, you can quickly grab them back out and maybe they're not going to be uh, destroyed. I don't know. Uh, so last thing we'll talk about is really what they sound like. Um, the best way I can pair this is you say you're, say you're at a, at a concert, at, 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 you listen to the radio or something like that in room. So you're inside the room that the radio is playing and let's say it's got great sound. Okay. That would be, that would be the pros. If you were to walk out of that room, you still hear it. It's still clear, but it's not like you're in the room. That's what this is. I would compare these very much. So like to my Raycons, very similar in sound. It's fine. It's just, it's not great. That's, that's the really the big difference in sound quality between these two. It's good, but it's not great. So I don't regret this purchase. I do plan to take these to work and use these um, just because they're DeWalt. And I feel like if you're a DeWalt fan, just like I am, I'm like, I'm, I'm a huge, huge, huge DeWalt guy. I like all their tools. I love all their tools. I mean, I have, that really didn't show you. The amount of stuff I have, this fan, it, it it should bleed yellow if you were to cut into it. I'll, just, I'll put it that way. Um, but I like DeWalt products. This is a solid DeWalt product. I will, I will say that. Um, as far as where to buy this, Lowe's Home Depot right now is the only place I know you can get it. It's not sold on Amazon. Uh, most of the Home and Depots, most of the Lowe's and Home Depots uh, do not have this out. It's in their overstocks. A lot of them I called have even pulled it down to put it anywhere. So you'll need the item number, which, because they'll have to look it up <clears throat> for you. I don't know. This is not going to help you at all. If you can see that. Actually, now I'm showing it to you, it's probably going to be like backwards. So that's even going to be more confusing. Um, the way I ended up finding it, I got on Lowe's website and typed in DeWalt wireless. No, I typed in DeWalt Bluetooth earbuds and these popped up and then you get the item number from that. But that's how I was tracking these things down. Um, I was on a list to get called when they showed up. So <clears throat> anyway, you got any questions, anything like that, please leave a comment uh, and subscribe. Of course, subscribe and I will get to your question uh, really quickly. All right, that's it.